Hi, I'm Kiki from Kika Goods. Today we are going to unbox Shaka Light Sprite Series Blind Box before diving in. And don't forget to hit subscribe button in the lower right corner for more unboxing reviews. So, this is how the box looks. It's got this really cute image of one of the figures on the front. Just like a light sprite, which is so pretty. Anyway, I'm so excited to open these up. So let's just get into it. Here, the candlelight on the cover is my favorite in this series. On the side, which are illustrations of all the styles, including 12 regular styles and one hidden styles. I want all of them. Okay, the first one. Let's see. Who's in this one? I'm absolutely sure this is a regular one, firewood figure, no matter the color usage or the design. It's fantastic. As you can see, it resembles firewood in a fireplace with the distress technique, which shows the texture of charred wood. As we can see, there are some additional accessories. There's a small flame, then it comes a candle holder. Additionally, the socket is designed as a heart-shaped groove, both of which have a unique design depending on the character. The little flame can be rotated 360 degrees, making it incredibly cute. It's wrapped in a rich blaze, and the red flames are also transparent, which is very captivating. The neck part has a bit of a retro design that I really like. Overall, it's a very cool design. You can see. Even its identity card is designed with great textures. This one is not hidden, but I like it very much. Okay, let's continue. Wow, so pretty. You know, it's the figure wave. Let's take a closer look at the details. The hair looks like melting candle wax, shaped like cascading waves, and it's gradient transparent, somehow mysterious and dreamy. It may be hard to see through the camera, but the fine sparkles on it resemble sunlight reflecting off the sea, incredibly captivating. She holds a delicate little seashell in her hand and has two pearl hair ornaments. This reminds me of The Little Mermaid. These are her accessories. Let's put them on her. Just like its name, it shimmers and is full of ocean vibes. I'm really impressed with this one. Now, the next one. Wow, do you know this one? The black and white color scheme creates a serene atmosphere with the interplay of light and shadow and the gradient effect, which has a deep sense of mystery. It has a stunning detail, especially the embossed textures that replicate the real feel of the moon's surface. Although this looks a bit cold, it's cute in my opinion. I'm sure you'll appreciate this design detail just as much as I do. Here we have number four. We got the candlelight, it's the cover actually. I think it's practically a work of art. Shaka shows that classic praying pose. Look its eyes, which seem to have twinkling stars. Besides that, its body is adorned with little stars, making it incredibly charming. 
The candle holder is in a wooden. I definitely feel a lot of vintage texture. From the back, her hair looks like melting wax with stars sprinkled on it. It's extremely beautiful. What amazes me the most is its gradient spray design. Just like the way candlelight transitions from bright to dark, the light and shadow effects are so delicate. Overall, I'm absolutely in love with this candlelight. Okay, moving on to the next box. This one is called Rainbow, and I loved it as soon as I heard the name. You know, the design is incredibly soothing, using a pastel macaron color scheme. We can see the long rainbow arcs over its head like a scroll, reminiscent of sunlight hitting bubbles. I mean, it's so dreamy. Oh, we can see there are even clouds in its eyes. I would like to say the hollow flame design is a brilliant touch, and the flame also seems to be its headband. It's so soft and pretty. It's truly irresistible. Would this be something you like? Up next. Look, this is a special beauty. A depiction of the Aurora. Its veil is incredibly layered. And the coolest part is the gradient fluorescent paint on top, showcasing the mysterious allure of the Aurora. And the stars on her hands and dress are also stunning. To be honest, I've never seen the Aurora in person, but this figure captures its essence beautifully. Now, I'm looking forward to an unforgettable Aurora spectacle. I am totally addicted to this series. Have you found your favorite already? All right, we got this figure, Shadow of the Trees. I'm certain this is my favorite one in this series. As for my favorite part, it is the long, leaf-like hair, which is absolutely beautiful. You can see the pearlescent gradient effect showcases the contours, and details of tree shadows almost looks like real leaves in a way. Additionally, it features not only flowers and a bird, but the most surprising detail is the actual tree hollow on the back. It's so clever. Here through the hollow, you can see the back of the little bird. It's an incredibly adorable design. It's a piece with great artistic sense, and I highly recommend it. Now, turning our attention to this one. So obviously, we got this one, Lightning. Its purple hair design is stunning, perfectly capturing the bright and dazzling quality of lightning. Even the flame is shaped like lightning, with great detail. Did you notice that this one has many lightning elements? There's even a transparent lightning accessory that we can place in its hand. As for Shaka, it wears a silver white cloak with a strong metallic feel. The candle holder base is also silver, what a cool design. For some reason, I feel like this design is infused with a sense of futuristic technology, which is truly eye-catching. Honestly, each one in this series is meticulously designed. Okay, now I'm wondering what the other one is. Oh my god. This is a hidden figure I am looking forward to, although I do love other regular styles as well. Just as its name suggests, the hair part resembles a burned candle with a slightly vintage color tone. And I even feel that its texture is more like that of a candle. As for the flame, you see, it looks more like the lingering smoke after a candle has been blown out. We can see the base is protected by foam, 
if you look closely. Its candle holder is different from others. It has two layers and is obviously a little higher. Moreover, this one can be sat on directly without a socket. I really appreciate its sleeping posture, lying on the knees with eyes closed, looking so pretty. Anyway, so excited to get this one. Let's open it up and appreciate it. I'm sure we got the figure sunset glow. It looks so gentle, and the actual product is even more beautiful than the pictures. The overall purple and pink color schemes are soft and lovely. In particular, the gradient design makes it resemble the flowing twilight in the sky, reminiscent of a stunning sunset. Here, what's in its hand? I see. It's a sunset, perfectly illuminating the hair, with the eyes also in that warm, bright pink. It's truly breathtaking. It's such a vivid design, I would really love to have it. I am so curious about this one. Wow, it's Firefly. It's also my favorite one for sure. This one is really cute. It's a bit different. You can see this part of the design resembles wood carving, including the flame on the top. And I love how glossy it is. On the back, it has a pair of firefly wings with a metallic paint design. The transparent gradient tail is so cute. Look here, it has this string of fireflies, which is supposed to be placed in this container on its hands. And it's simply stunning. So, do you like this little firefly? The last one. I can tell you we got the meteor figure. In my opinion, this one is full of whimsy and romance. These clear eyes sparkle with endless starlight and her little feet are playfully pointed, and she looks truly joyful. In its hands, it holds a shooting star, capturing the fleeting beauty of a meteor shower. It has a lovely starry cape on the back, which is so pretty. Honestly, this one wasn't initially my favorite type, but now it feels like a little fairy, incredibly adorable. So far, which detail of this figure is your favorite? Thank you so much for watching our blind box unboxing video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to smash that like button and share it with your fellow collectors. And of course, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more unboxing content. This is Kiki from Kika Goods. See you next time.